Quality Gaming here. Today I will be showing you how to make 3D text with Fonto and PS Touch. So just to tell you right now, if you really like those music tutorials, I will not be adding music to my tutorials because it will get you distracted and it just doesn't work out. So yeah, there will be no music and <clears throat> obviously you will need Fonto and PS Touch. So it's not really that hard. I mean, it's not hard, hard, but... Yeah, I'll just show you how to do it, and yeah, so I will see you guys in Fonto first. Okay guys, here we are in Fonto, so the first thing you are going to need to do for your 3D text is press the camera, then press play an image, then pick the white one, and then use. Then you just want to tap it and press add text. And then you can make whatever you want your 3D text to be, so I'm just going to use test. And I don't like this font, so I'm going to change it. Size. No, I don't want to do that. I want to go to style. And I want to choose create color pattern. Then black. And then blue. Then I want to change it to a vertical. And here we go. Like that. And... You guys will want to add a small stroke to it, mainly black. Black looks nice for it. So there we go. And you do not want to save it to your camera roll. You want to just press here, then open in other apps, and then press copy to PS Touch. And I will see you guys in PS Touch. Okay, here we are in PS Touch, and this will be the first thing you will come to. So the first thing you want to do is press the little left right corner, just hold on, and then slide up to Magic Wand Tool. Then you just want to tap the white background, then press that button and press cut. And then after that, you just want to go inside all of these little spots in here like if you have like any letters which will have insides then you need to go and cut the white backgrounds out of them and that is not much right now so yeah so then you want to go over and duplicate layer and then you want to go back in and then tap that one and then deselect that one and then you want to press directional blur and then don't worry about the angle. You can bring it up to 23. 23 is perfect. So there we go. And now you just want to keep duplicating layer over and over and over. Until it says maximum layers reached. Then you want to go over there. Tap that and press merge visible. Okay and wait for it loading. And then you just want to do it again. Duplicate layer. Maximum layers reached. Merge visible. Wait for it to load. And there we go. So after you do that, you just want to select that one again. And there we go. There is your 3D text. And if you want to change it up a little bit, you want to tap the one on the bottom press and and then press transform then you can like make it look like that which I personally think looks really cool so yeah my storage is kinda full so yeah that is all you have to do for your 3d text so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope it helped you a lot stay athletic and comment any questions you have about tutorials or anything i am waiting to give an answer so please watch my next video and see you guys next time